Hey, hey, this is Nerion, and welcome back to another brand new episode of First Take. If you're not familiar with this series, this is where myself and a special guest sit down and we take a look at some upcoming indie titles or short games that are available to play on PC. We uh, do a little playthrough of the demo or short game with some first impressions. And then at the end, we give a very unique take on a scoring system with some of our final thoughts on the game. Uh, now, joining us today is another lovely member of the Redirected crew. If you remember, I'm the Finger from our very first episode. And joining us today is one of his esteemed colleagues, Controlled. Controlled, welcome. That's me. It is you, if in case you forgot. You're, you're not Finger, so you are yourself today. I hope not. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, welcome, and uh, good to have you here on this episode of First Take. Neither of us have really looked at this game from what I've seen, just because uh, I did a little bit of research. It looks like kind of similar to, similar to Ori in the Blind Forest, but Control here hasn't seen anything, so you know we're pretty much just going straight in fresh. So, um, excited to get started? The music already sounds a lot like the Ori menu. Really? Oh, okay. I've not actually played Ori in the Blind Forest, but I, it's on my list of long lists it's, of games. It's really good. I heard, I, I heard it hits it's, you in It's super difficult. <laughs> Apparently this one has some challenges as well, so let's, uh, let's jump right in. Uh, and just for everyone watching at home, <laughs> uh, <laughs> I am actually using controller for this, so uh, we'll probably give some feedback. Well, I'll give my thoughts on uh, how the controller is. It is partial controller support uh, per Steam. So this, this game is available as the Steam demo right now. So I'll give some feedback on that as well. So just, just this menu already looks like Ori. <laughs> There's a darkness that... Fuck, that went too quick. <laughs> <laughs> just pause the video, you'll be fine. Yeah, please pause for that bit. A lone spirit sets off to break it. What was it breaking? But what awaits him? Countless obstacles line his path. Those are definitely tentacles. Oh, Cthulhu's in it too. Trial of wisdom and courage to seek answers to the darkness. That was quite quick. There's a light somewhere up there. Oh, good. Thank you. <laughs> I, th I thought you were going to read it. So I, I blinked. <laughs> <laughs> the music actually also kind of reminds me of Final Fantasy XIV. It's got that kind of very Japanese-esque style. Okay. I don't know what I'm supposed to do <laughs> here. <laughs> Am I supposed to do something with this? Maybe just keep moving? Yeah, okay. I don't know. Normally in games like this, they'll give you the button prompts. Oh, there you go. Like that. <laughs> Oh, I'm loving this. The, the character looks really slow. Moving. Well, it's very smooth. Yeah. Ori was one of the the better platform uh, 2D platformers. Well, so far this is. I like the the colors on it though. Yeah, yeah, the colors are really nice. <clears throat> oh, here we go. So I think, from my understanding, you're supposed to be some kind of sea fairy, something along those lines. Text. The path ends here. 
You can actually read these now. Maybe it's as they say. We fairies weren't meant to leave the darkness of the seabed. Ooh. I couldn't have been the first to come up with this idea. Others before me must have gotten this far too, only to give up in the face of this impossible distance. But what can I do about it? The distance is greater than my abilities will allow. You can do a lot about it if you just believe. I do believe in fairies. <laughs> <laughs> I hate this feeling. Aw. <laughs> Damn. Who's there? Is someone there? And just, just me. I'm watching you. Oh, yes, I am apparently watching you. I fell asleep. <laughs> <laughs> the eye effect. Chin up, lad. <laughs> I just looked to the ceiling for that. Chin up, child. Trust in the light in your heart. I can offer it this. Did I miss something? Sorry. I didn't realize it was there. Uh, I thought I was controlling it. It may not be as much, but it should be enough to set you in motion. Okay. I thought I was prompting the dialogue there, but I wasn't. Because <laughs> I, the first couple times I happened to press A at the exact right time. Yeah, when you miss it, I'm, I don't know if I should speak about it or not. Uh, you know what? Let's keep it non-professional, so feel free. <laughs> uh, Are you going to fly already? Look at that. Oh, okay. That's weird. <laughs> you good? There we go. Ooh, okay. Oh, that's cool. Okay. There lay many challenges ahead, but there is one thing you ought to always know. You are not alone. You never will be. Uh huh. Stay steadfast in your determination. Help will arrive in due course. In time, your path will cross and join with... That of a certain trustworthy companion. As for the identity of this fairy, that is not for me to reveal. Some questions have answers only you can discover. Trust yourself and trust those you meet who are worthy of holding your trust. I expect you to be amazing readers. <laughs> Sorry? I expect you to be amazing readers. You expected me to be amazing? No, they, uh, they did. Oh, they did. Okay. They like expect us to uh, be speed reading. That's okay, maybe just um, either have all the text as prompts or slow it down a little bit. Might be good. Oh, okay, so it's it It doesn't follow the character that just moves off you into the next section. Yeah, it's, it's a weird cut. <clears throat> yeah, it's, I mean, it's different. That was a spike. <laughs> I saw that coming. <laughs> oh, I was not paying attention to the spikes. Look at that. Woo, look at me go. Oh, okay. How am I supposed to get... Oh, wait, re Maybe, oh, re yeah, yeah. recharge. Okay. Oh, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm seeing the pattern now. <laughs> I don't know what that is. Yeah, I'm not too sure what that was either. Oh. It was like a secret orb or something. Hmm. Maybe there are just abilities you unlock later? Yeah. I wonder... One second. Let's have a look. I don't think there was any... I don't think there was any other um, buttons for you to press, right? Yeah, it's just interact. Jump, fly, grab. Okay. The Y is to interact with something. Ooh. <laughs> I was waiting. 
Uh, um, you had to, to like jump just right enough to get around the corner there. Yeah, I'm really good at yeah, this. Yeah, there thing. was a lot of a lot of this stuff in Ori. Alright, I'll get, I'll get the hang of it. Maybe not. Oh no! <laughs> As he dies again. <laughs> okay. I mean, I don't blame you. This stuff is difficult. Yeah. Oh. Okay. 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 I haven't. I don't play a lot of platformers anymore. Okay. All right. Just getting familiar with the controls and everything. So. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> uh, I'd like to apologize to the developer of how awful I am. <laughs> Wait, have I got to... Um, Whoa, one second. That's what I was thinking, but I don't think that'll work. One second, I think I can do it. I did. Oh, oh, I see, I see. I've got to do it on each one. I didn't see the one in the back over there. Oh, man. I would like to apologize. Guys, for being awful <laughs> at this game. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Oh, come on. I thought I was... Okay, 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 okay. Oh, you little, uh, lovely person. <laughs> yes! There oh, God, go. a sense of accomplishment when you actually do no, it. it gets worse. <laughs> it's okay. No, 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 no the bad t that was bad timing. This one's not too no. hard. Wait, what was that? Was I? Was the, did I just teleport what? into a new kingdom or something? <laughs> yes. Okay. I'm understanding things now. <laughs> you think it's easier to go over the top? Uh. No. <laughs> I mean, I was looking at hitting. I don't know if you'll be able to do it, but I think the middle one flying up and then going right. Oh, I was trying to be. I don't think you can get around the bottom. Yeah, no. Oh. Mm, yeah. Oh. There you go. Yes. Oh, God. Oh, great. <laughs> it gets worse. <laughs> I can't grab on that. Oh. What oh, am I supposed to... Oh, I think I know what. I couldn't even tell you. <laughs> wrong, wrong side to grab onto. I need to try and go around to that edge. Oh! Oh? I wasn't even thinking about that. Yeah. Ooh. Look at that. Look at that. I'm... One second. Yeah, I'm a pro now. Oh, um, well, this looks like more fun for me. Okay, let's go. Ah, okay. 
health. Hey! Ah! Oh, how do I... Uh, oh, sh 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 she... She... Nope. Nope. No. <laughs> That's a lot of no. no. Just barely did that. It it was it was much faster than you were. Yeah, it was it, it was catching me. Oh, what's this? <laughs> Looks yeah. fun. Okay. the most skilled platformer. Uh, you're a lot better than I am. Well, I appreciate the uh, vote confidence there. <laughs> I'm better at shooting games, not strategy games. Yeah. When it comes to thinking at the same time, it, that's what hurts me. that it went so well Look at you <laughs> figuring it out yes yes i surely did not make any mistakes earlier in this recording <laughs> no no definitely not oh i didn't realize there was stuff floating in the background there it's like uh stingrays or something yeah can i move yet i think they're manta rays but stingrays yeah. manta rays i mean i don't think they're either Probably not. I'm not an ocean fan. Oh. Fly into the the thing. Ooh. Well, that that wow. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Got lucky. Oops. <clears throat> yes. Okay. Okay. Where'd the music go? Did we run out of music? Is that our free trial up? Yeah, did the... Welcome <laughs> to the music. I guess it just stopped. Oh. Hit the wall. Oh no! <laughs> right at the end. Yeah, right. I just want to know what happened to the music. Where's my music? Oh no. <laughs> the music gave you energy. Yeah, the music was like giving me motivation. Because I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're doing your best. And that's all that matters. Now I gotta do better. Look at that. Figuring it out for the first time. Right. Just uh, ace platform and Nereon right here. <laughs> Watch me die now. Karma's is right around the corner for me. 
Because that's usually, it's usually what happens. <laughs> Easy. Easy peasy. There we go. Ow. Sorry. I don't know how you didn't hit the spike right there. Right? There you go. I hit spike. <laughs> and again. Thanks. <sighs> Make you do this one really fast. Yeah. Oh, come on. I was there. I was there. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh god. I mean, the good part is there's no way you can fail that. <laughs> you say that, I got close to the spike there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey, the light! Oh. What? Oh, it turns it turns the 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 deadly orb into a good orb. Oh. Just getting rid of the lasers. That's cool. What happened to you? I wasn't even looking at you. <laughs> oh. That's actually pretty cool. That's that's awesome. I love that. Where's it going? I just don't know where I was supposed to go, though. You gotta rush up top for it, I guess. I don't know if you can dash from there up to the platform above you. Like the wall. Ooh! Ooh! Look Ooh. at that. Skill! So what's going on now? Oh, I gotta unlock the, uh... I guess you just dash back through it. Yeah, if I can avoid spikes. Oh, I didn't even see those. <laughs> I'm, uh... Don't worry, I'm getting worse. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, I'm getting worse. <laughs> oh, I could have dashed again. But I didn't. Just one more dash and you would have had it. <laughs> There's more. Oh no. Billy Maze. Um That's that's not really what I wanted to do. Uh... Oh. Lord almighty. Oh. Well, he really had uh, nosedived into that. Oh. No, I need to go under, don't I? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Oh no, that's that's not okay. <laughs> nope. It's always 
there's that one spike. Yeah. It's that one... That one spike, and I can't... Very... No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Good luck. I'll do raid start. Oh, wow, I can't jump. <laughs> oh, come on, that was... How? This looks like a lot of fun. Oh, wow. Okay, yeah, that... <laughs> that does look like a lot of fun. Oh, no. Okay. Yeah, that's not, that's not how you do things. <laughs> what? <laughs> I thought I was grabbing onto it, and I wasn't. I think you got it. Yes! Yeah. The <laughs> sense of no. accomplishment. <laughs> oh, God. No. Why do this to me? Oh. <laughs> oh, I can't remember. I can't memorize all this. Is there still more? <laughs> what? <laughs> Oh no, okay. Oh, I got it the first time. Oh, I need to, I was trying to go too far. Oh, I am trying to be like Mr. Fancy Pants. Oh, come on. What happened to the music though? If we used their free trial. Oh, I cannot get it to go over that. It's too difficult now. I'm finding the first bit very difficult now. Um... This, this is getting uh, very... Might be losing my mojo. <laughs> this is a platformer. It's... This is what they do to you. Oh gosh. I'm just really struggling with this one jump. I don't know how to go get over it easily. see uh, okay I thought you were crazy apparently not I I had it I landed on it at least I thought I did oh it's this I held my breath in for that. <laughs> I'm not even going to play. I was like, I've got it. 
I've got it. No, I don't got it. <laughs> What? Did I hit the spike? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Just uh impressive. Most impressive. Okay, okay, okay. Oh God. I'm not even <laughs> making the first jump now. How did I just go straight through it? I dashed completely through it. Did I not? Nah. Nah? Oh, you don't think I did that? Okay. Nah. Oh, Lord. I just fell off. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Look at that. Oh my God. Oh, oh wait. There's more. Thanks oh, for that playing. Was it. Hey. Yes. <laughs> yes. The sense of accomplishment. Oh, yes. Now what? Yes. Is that it? Just. <laughs> Just thanks for playing. Oh. All right. Okay. So after my terribly non-professional playthrough of. Uh, Lumion. Um, uh, we're going to look at scoring and a f sort of final verdict. So, for those of you that have forgotten or new to this series, our scoring system is a little bit unique here. So, it's a three point system. And how that works is three out of three, we loved it. Two out of three, it's decent. And one out of three, it's a thing. And we look at gameplay, visuals, sound, and story. And then just a final verdict at the end with some of our final thoughts, maybe some suggestions or things we'd like to see in the full game or, you know, in future updates. So, let's start off with gameplay. So, controlled. I mean, I haven't done a ton of platformers in a while. Uh,. I can't even remember the last time I did play a platformer. I know we've briefly, I know we've mentioned uh, Ori, the Ori game in the Blind Forest. I haven't played that one, so I guess from, for me, it was quite a fresh perspective as far as like the gameplay itself, but it was very challenging um, platformer game with the puzzles. Yep. I mean, I got. I said it's really hard not to compare it to Ori because there's a lot of similarities. Yeah, but I mean, in a way, it had its own unique things, like the, um, like the the bounce bouncy walls with the spikes. That was actually unique. I've never seen that. It was pretty nice to see new things like that. Right. So it's got its own unique mechanics in it. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, overall, I, I I didn't try using keyboard and mouse in the end, everybody. It just, I stuck to the gamepad. Uh, and any mistakes in the gameplay just came down to me fumbling on the controller. 
um, some of my keys, some of my buttons sticking every now and then. Uh, that's my excuse, at least. <laughs> <laughs> but overall, I mean, it said partially supported. It worked flawlessly, pretty much. I had no issues. It was smooth, easy to use. So, I mean, I would definitely, based on the control scheme, uh, I think this is a game that's best on a controller. Maybe some experts out there would be amazing on keyboard, but for me, I feel like, uh, especially like using an analog stick for the directional when you're um, shooting yourself with those little discs into different directions, it might be easier on and with using an analog stick. Maybe not for me, because I just shoot myself into the spikes all the time, but <laughs> for anyone that's a competent platform gamer, uh, yeah, I, I thought overall the gameplay was really fun. It was very, very challenging. Um, at least for me, like, you know, it's maybe sometimes I was, you know, it, it can be a bit frustrating when you're not able to solve it, but at the same time, I still really wanted to get through it. And once, once I found the routine, especially like towards the end there, I felt like, okay, yeah, there was some times where I'd mess up at the beginning, but once I got down the, the timing and everything, it felt very smooth to me, so. Yep. Would you have any other final remarks on, on the gameplay? I, I just think that, it, you know, like, there's a few things that need to be tweaked, like like the movement, I noticed. Right. But th those are easy little tweaks uh, from just my one year of doing game design in high school. Stuff like that can be fixed easily. Yeah. Um, but other than that, I didn't, I didn't really see any major flaws in the gameplay, so... Okay. So, I mean, I loved it. We loved it. So we're going to give it three out of three because we loved it. So moving on to visuals. Um, yeah, I mean, I have zero complaints about visuals. It's a very visually appealing game to look at. The overall design of the levels um, look great. Uh, a lot of the stuff that's going on in the background as well. Yeah, I like I like the the whole underwater feeling, be able to see the the creatures in the background. Yeah, move as you go along the level. Gives you that kind of relaxed, tranquil feeling until you get thrown with the most challenging puzzle of your life. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. So yeah, no, I I, I think uh, yeah, it's an interesting interesting concept as well for the overall design. Yeah, like choosing underwater I think was a great choice. It fits really well. Uh, the main character looks great, fantastic. So, is there any that think uh, what 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 do you feel like stood out most visually for you? Uh, it was really just the backgrounds of the levels. Yeah, yeah. It's not dull. It's it's, it's gives you a sense of depth, I think, to each level with what's going on. So, yeah. Uh, well, I guess we're in agreement on visuals as well. We loved them too, so visuals also gets a three out of three. We loved it. Yay! Yay. So, moving on to sound. Um, I'll let you start with this one. I mean, just listening to the, the menu music and the music throughout the game, it's it's really peaceful and it, like, just like the the whole environment thing like, it just gives you that sense of like ambiance like, it just feels calming yeah uh, honestly like this this music itself i could just have this like playing in the background while working or something or reading a book it, it, it's that type of music you know just that kind of like very relaxing ambiance music that you you might listen to on youtube when you're studying or something It's nice. Yeah. Uh, I thought overall all the sound effects were nice and nice and clean. Like, um, and the uh, only maybe like a slight criticism I could say is that those like um, those those water beams sounded a little bit like static. That I thought there was like static on my audio, but it was just those things spinning around. So, but. It, yeah, yeah. I was just saying, it sounded a little bit more like static than actual, like like a whirlpool or whatever it's supposed to sound like. Um, yeah, just didn't have, didn't sound like it was, 
it was that. I didn't realise it was that. That was what was making the sound. So I thought maybe there was an issue with my audio <laughs> at the time. I mean, by the waterfalls, it did sound a little loud, but that was just me. Yeah. Yeah, because I'm I'm streaming to you, so I, you know, maybe it's coming for you to you quite loud. So, but yeah, no, I I don't hear the exact thing. But yeah, I, I overall audio was great. Uh, I thought it was kind of, thought it was kind of nice that they didn't maybe give like a, an actual voice to the characters. Like they had that, you know, it was it was kind of cute. It's like the whole Nintendo. Yeah, feel. yeah, a little bit of a classic vibe, you know, a little bit of a retro feel to it, which I kind of like that as well. So, um, so I would also give, um, yeah, we're gonna give sound three out of three as well. Uh, we loved it. Um, finally, we're moving on to story. Um, now, briefly, when we were discussing this uh, before we were recording our scoring section. Uh, we did say that, you know, it would have been nice to have a little bit more story, but also at the same time, we understand that, you know, it is a demo. Um, so it is almost like a bit of a tease as well, like a bit of a taster of, you know, what you're going to get in the full product. So although I would say I would have liked to have had more story, um, it's, yeah, it, it got me interested enough to, you know, want to, want to find out more about, you know, the story itself to, you know see where, you know, this uh, fairy's uh, journey is going. Yeah, the story they gave at the beginning uh, was enough for the for the demo. Yeah. So there, there could be a lot more in the game. My, my only suggestion would be either to have all the dialogue promptable with a button so you can just prompt it to continue. It was a little bit of a mix and match in both. Like some of it you could prompt to continue the dialogue and some of it just came along and it, it went by a little bit too quick. Um, so maybe either just slow it down a little bit if you're you know, not gonna have the prompt there to continue the dialogue on. Uh, just so it gives you know the, the player a little bit more time to read through. Uh, Cause I did feel like I had to speed read a little bit and there was some bits I dialogue I missed when I blinked. <laughs> <laughs> one tiny blink. It's one tiny blink and it's like, oh, where is it going? <laughs> yeah, slowing it down would help it a lot because it'll still give the this, this smooth transition feel. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. I mean, in retrospect, obviously there is two of us watching this at the same time, but, <laughs> you know, if, if, if this becomes a game that gets popular on Twitch and streamers are playing it, and you know, and they're reading out for their audience. You know, it's good to, especially because the the whole vibe of the game is like very. Tra aside from you know, obviously when you get into the puzzles, it's it's quite tense, and you got to be quick with reaction times. But uh, the overall like story is 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 very mellow. So just to slow down that a little bit, or like I said, just a, a button prompt to continue the dialogue would be great. Um. But yeah, I'm, I'm actually looking forward to seeing what the full story is like, and uh, yeah, I'm excited to see uh, how that turns out in the full game. I might, uh, I might get myself a coffee. Seemed kind of interesting. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I definitely want to hurt my brain. <laughs> but it's, it's worth yeah, it. Yeah, definitely. So story we're giving that a three out of three we loved it as well so perfect perfect scores all around obviously you know we're, we're giving it a three out of three on everything uh we understand it's a demo there's tweaks here and there and you know here and there that need to be made to the game uh, from up from what we've seen so far but uh i'm pretty sure that will be addressed in the full in the full game and yeah like i said overall it was a great experience playing this game um i'm very rusty on platformers so you know i did get a little bit tense there you know and, and stressed with some of the puzzles but that's the nature of platformers and i think if i had been playing platformers more frequently than i have been in the last several years uh might have been a little bit less stressful for me <laughs> so yeah maybe not oh, maybe not maybe i'm just still they're all, they're all difficult yeah. <laughs> 
So let's move on to our final verdict. So any final thoughts um, and control, I'll, I'll let you take this one again. Any sort of final thoughts you want to mention on the Lumion? No, it was, it was a great game overall. There were a few things here and there that could be fixed. Um, but for a demo, for what it is, it's, it looked like a lot of fun. Yeah, definitely. Um, it's a lot longer than I expected it to be for a demo. I mean, I know we got to take into account how many times we retried um, the the puzzles that really kind of stumped us. Um, but hey, we got a lot of playtime out of it. So, and honestly, uh, you know, this is great seeing more demos become available on PC again. Even if it's, you know, I, I remember back in the day when you get like the PC game gamer magazines with the demo disc and everything. I got a lot of those for for Xbox. Yeah, so it's it's good to see demos kind of coming back, and I think this is a, this great way to showcase these type of games that are coming out. So yeah, uh, there isn't much more we can really say. Uh, all I can really say though is you should definitely check out this game if you haven't yourself. Uh, it's apparently releasing summer this year, so it should be very soon. Uh, the developer had an event on Twitter where they were giving away copies of the game uh, with sharing screenshots and videos and tagging them in it and they're announcing the winner well they're, they're going to be uh, gifting out the free copies of the game to the winners tomorrow so congratulations to the, the winners for tomorrow and yeah check this studio ch studio out the developer is Glimmer Studio and the publisher is Perfect World Games Singapore uh, Perfect World who um I believe it's the same perfect what I'm familiar with that uh, has published uh, Star Trek Online. Uh, but this is their Singapore di division. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. Check them out. I'm going to leave links in the description. Uh, so you can go check them out on Steam and on Twitter. Controlled here. Um, big thank you to you for persevering through this with me uh we had we, it's great seeing you die over and over yeah, we had a we had a few hiccups uh with recording but we we got through it and yeah i just really appreciate you taking part in the our first take of lumio yeah it was fun uh so as i said earlier in the video uh controlled is part of the redirected group so links are in the description for redirected and controls youtube channel and he also streams on twitch so check him out give him a follow give them a sub they're a really entertaining group of guys that do some awesome playthroughs and uh some funny banter as well occasionally yeah i'm not as quiet over there as i am here <laughs> this is a bit different for me so uh, it's a little more personal <laughs> Occasionally, I replace Kevin over there, so... <laughs> yeah, it seems more and more people are replacing him. <laughs> <laughs> he's, no, he, he's, he's got a thing going on, so uh, he can't be here uh, a lot right now. Well, like I said, you guys put out some great content. Um, and yeah, links are in the description for anyone who wants to go check them out. Like I said, throw some su subs over and throw them some follows. And thanks for joining us on our first take of Lumion. I really hope that's how it's pronounced, and I apologize if we've been saying it wrong. If it was Lumi1 the entire time, I... <laughs> <laughs> I, will, I think it's Lumion. Yeah. <laughs> Lumion. Um, on Steam right now, available to play the demo. Thanks for joining me once again. Don't forget to also check me out on Twitch and links in the description and don't forget to like and subscribe for more content so yeah we'll see you very soon I have once again been a non-professional gamer and we'll see you in the next one that's a wrap